Hey everybody, thank you for tuning into my channel. Today I have a video that's requested by MJ on what fits in my Coach Outlet Basquiat Collaboration bucket bag. Um, so stay tuned and I'll show you what fits. See you in a bit. All right, so this video is requested by MJ and she wanted to know what fits in this Coach bucket bag or what do I carry in it? Um, right now it, it's not that full, so let me show you. And I don't have the strap on. I was uh, IMing her about my one con about this after wearing it for a little bit is, um, and it's just me, the strap that comes with it is a little on the thin side. I like thicker straps. So, um, you know, the length is perfectly fine. It's just a little thin for me. So I tend to use a thicker strap with this bag, um, but I don't have it on because it, rattle, it rattles around if I have it on. So I'm going to leave it off. So let's show you what I have here. It's not full really. So I don't know if you can see in there, but um, right there. So in this middle zip pocket, I keep my keys. Let me reach it. And it's a pretty deep pocket. So if you see here, I can stick my hand in it like that oh and I'm wearing my beanie because my hair is a mess and I need a haircut which is on Monday so in the meantime I'm wearing this uh, so it's the Grace Coddington collab it's the little pouch uh, this is a little Hermes pre-love but I think it's so cute with the little tiger there uh, so but it is, it's just my car keys and um, house keys are in here. But it's so cute, this little one. But uh, this fits inside this pouch. It goes all the way in and there's still room to fit more. I don't like to keep it that bulky because then, you know, it'll bulk out like that. So, um, but just the keys in here, it still close, closes, closes very easily. Right, so in this front section here, here's the pattern here with the little T-Rex. Uh, right here in front, I just have some mints and my wallet. I just switched out today. This is the Louis Vuitton. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> it's like, a, I don't I don't know what it's called, but I, it just snaps closed. Uh, and then you can put your cards and everything in here. It also has a little zip front here, but I don't really put anything in here. If I didn't have my keys in that Grace Connington and I'm just carrying one key, it could fit in there. But I like to keep this pretty flat um, so it doesn't intrude into this part. And then back here, I have a single dollar bill, one, one dollar in cash. But that usually I try to stick my bills back here if I don't have too much. So that's what I'm using right now as of today. Uh, there is nothing else in here. And the back side of the bag, right now I just have my mask. So that's everything that fits in there right now. But let's fill it up. Uh, let's see what fits. I can tell you what doesn't fit. So if you have one of these, the pochette 19, um, there's something in here. Oh, it's a little bag holder. Uh, so this I don't think fits. So let me zip it up. And let me see if it fits. It won't fit this way, obviously. So if you wanted to carry it vertical, it fits. You, you won't be able to button it, snap close it, but if you put it that way, it fits. So if you don't mind, it goes in that way. So since the 19 fits, then obviously the little one 14? What is it? Whatever this little one is, that'll fit. This one might fit um, horizontal. Let's see. So let's, uh, here it is. Horizontal. You can drop it right in. So it fits. There it is at the bottom. See, so it, it you still have a lot of room at the top. Uh, but it fits comfortably that way, and obviously it'll fit uh, that way too. So this definitely you can use. This, I don't like it going in this way, so I probably won't use this in this bag unless it's, you absolutely, absolutely had to use it. Oh, this bracelet, by the way, is by an artisan in Mexico. He, they hand beaded it and uh, made this by hand. So I thought it was really cool. So I'm wearing it today. 
Uh, what else? Uh, another pouch. Another pouch. The cosmetic pouch. It's smaller than the toiletry, and it's both in height and length. Uh, and it's but it's longer than the other pouch. So will this fit? It will not fit uh, this way. So like the 19, you have to go in this way. And obviously since it's shorter in height, it, it'll fit that way. Uh, however, like this, I don't like to put it in this way. So I probably won't use this in here unless absolutely necessary. If you don't mind, go ahead and use it. And knock yourself out your bag, your rules. Uh, it's not really a, it's not really a, a rule. There are, there are no rules. Uh, preference. It's your preference. All right. So what else do I have? Bah, bah, bah. Uh, our maze uh, little pouch, which I love carrying extra masks or anything in here, cords. Any, I use this a lot. So that's uh, something I really like. Obviously not that way even but going up vertical it's too tall so this will not work either all right so those are the big oh one more the little pochette the mini pochette this you know is similar to this so it'll fit right in there and i do use that a lot and again it's it's in there pretty deep uh if you want to use both on, on in the front section, you probably could. Yeah, you could. See, they they both fit in there like that. Uh, there's a lot of room up here, so if you wanted to put a mask or something, you, you can shove your mask in there, and it's, there's still room in there. All right, so you can use both both of those in the front side, or one in each, or whatever you want. And there's there's probably not any more room to go this way, but um, if you there's room on the side here. I don't know if you can see there. There's some, there's some room over here. Or, you know, it depends on what you say. So right here you can probably put, if you had, uh, this is just a little brush that I use lint. But if you have a brush or something like this, it'll probably fit on the side. And, you know, obviously a lip, lip balm will fit in there. But I'll probably put the lip balm in the middle here along with the keys. If you had hand sanitizer, let's see, here's a hand sanitizer here, or a mace, I guess. You can put it next to the side there, and that's probably all you can fit on the side, along with the two pochettes. And then, like I said, you, there's room at the top where you can, you can stick things up there. All right, so let me take those out for now. Um, and uh, show you what else that fits. Uh, we have a zippy compact wallet. Oh, look, it, fit, it fits. It, it fits this way. So you can either put it in this way, or if you want to do vertical, it fits there. Uh, if you want to do the push it accessoire and, uh, and the zippy compact wallet, they both fit in there. And like because it's tall, there's room to fill other things. And there's not as much room on the side for because it's a zippy compact wallet, but uh, as you can see, the pochette, uh, mini pochette, you can stick stuff on the side uh, because the mini pochette is smaller than the zippy compact wallet. All right, so if you want to do that. I haven't used the zippy compact wallet in a while. While I was traveling, I thought about bringing this, but I didn't bring it. Uh, but I, I really do love this. And I have the old style one where it opens up all the way. I don't really like the one that opens only like that. I do like the one that opens with the lay flat. Uh, but I, I love this this wallet, uh, just classic to have. So that's that. Uh, obviously, I have other things. If you have either one of these, the Chanel card case, you got a Louis pocket organizer, um, a compact wallet. These are all obviously fit. You can probably put three of these in, and if you had a clay, you can probably stick a clay in there too. So all four actually fits in there on one side like that. And you have lots of room again on this to put uh, anything cylindrical or um, vertical in there. Like um, 
if I wanted to put a tripod deal, it'll probably stick out. Oh no, it didn't. Look at that. Oh, look at that. So it fits on the side. And can I, the key is, can I close? Oh, look at that. I can close it. So yeah. Very cool. Um, you can fit a lot in here. This is something I got in Barcelona. This is a little um, Longchamp card holder. I would put euros in here uh, because I was getting too many euros and uh, it was very uh, bulking out my little wallet that I brought. I only brought like a little tiny um, clay. Uh, so I bought this in, in the Longchamp store. But it's really cool. It's big. Uh, it fits obviously right in in the bag, so I can use that. I don't have anything else to. Uh, oh, cologne! If you want to, I don't have cologne with me. I have a box. Let's use the box. So if you have like Tom Ford box cologne, uh, obviously the cologne will fit. If the box fits, the cologne will fit. I don't know why you would carry a bottle of cologne. It always baffles me why you would carry a whole bottle of cologne because, wow. Because sometimes if you walk by somebody and they're wearing too much cologne, it's a little overpowering. So I apologize if that's you, but yeah, don't do that. Uh, nobody wants to smell you that bad. Nobody, nobody wants to smell you that bad. Even if you're wearing effing fabulous, um, which I wanted to buy in Barcelona, but I didn't. Uh, Let's see. Let's see what I can stuff in here. Let's say I want to carry the mini pochette. Oh God. I want to carry this toiletry, whatever. My current wallet. Uh, some mints. Uh, this thing, whatever that is. Some sanitizer. Uh, this little wallet thing. Uh, my mask and a tripod thing, holder thing, key thing. Uh, probably gotta do some rearranging. Um, but I believe if I don't lay everything side by side, it'll obviously fit. Let me take the mask out because you can't see inside. Uh, it all fit in there like that. There's so much room you can do. That's not even utilizing the entire inside. I can probably put the outroids in the middle like that. You can load this baby up. If you have a uh, little earbuds, you can fit in there. If you want, uh, I don't know, a little Gaudi bull, you can probably shove him in there too. Uh, you probably can't carry everything. Let's say you want a little comfort animal. So you want a little go, go. you might you know no well no he doesn't really fit that well even if he's squishy so if you use a comfort animal you can't get a girthy comfort animal you have to get more of a slimline comfort animal but it'll fit um you want to carry dental floss or floss or these you can just throw them in uh, you want to carry your dust bag. Obviously, you can just shove it in there. Oh, a phone. I have the uh, Pixel. Um, it'll fit right in there, obviously. No problem. Uh, it fits in uh, this way, too, sideways there. Uh, it gets a little heavy, yes. Uh, but if you're wearing a strap, you can wear it cross body. I would put the uh, tripod in the back. Oh, camera. If I had a camera, which I'm using, so I can't, uh, it'll, it'll fit in here too. So you can carry quite a bit in here like that. Zipped up quite nicely. It doesn't, you know, it's, it's kind of uh, structured at the bottom, so it doesn't, it won't sag. Uh, and then the, the shape holds itself really well. So I think that's it. I don't have an iPad, so I can't show you what fits, but I don't think an iPad will fit in here. Uh, maybe an iPad mini. Uh, I do have, let's say like this. This is a old Huawei tablet. Uh, it's long. It's probably, I don't know how long it is, but um, it's a little tall, so it won't fit in there. Um, 
you know, if you had a power bank, it'll fit in there. You can carry it. Uh, I don't think I have any. Here's a Samsung Galaxy Tab. Uh, obviously, it's way too big, but if you just wanted to carry it like that, you could. Um, well, yeah, that's everything. This is the Coach Outlet. The Coach Basquiat Bucket Bag Collection. Got it at the Coach. Outlet. I actually ordered it online. Uh, it should be in your coach outlets now. I don't, I think it's sold out online. I'm not positive. I thought I saw something about that. But if you go check it out, you should be able to see it. There's something wrong here. Oh, there's a little scratch there. It's all right. I'm rough on my bags, I think. So, um, yeah, so that's everything. Oh, one more. If you had like an organizer, it fits, but Barely, you won't be able to um, button it. However, if you had the uh, pocket size agenda, that'll fit. It'll fit this was uh, horizontal and vertical uh, like that with lots of room to spare. All right, so that's everything. I can't pull anymore. If I had a rabbit, I'd pull it out of the hat too because that would be kind of a neat trick. So that's um, what fits in the bag. So hopefully you enjoy the video. Uh, if you're, if you have any questions or anything about this bag, go online and look. Not kidding. You can ask me down below. Just leave a comment, uh, and um, I'll try to answer it if I know the answer. So thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you have a great weekend, and I will catch you in my next video. I think I'll film another what's in my bag with that other uh, train case looking thing, the vanity bag. And, um, which is a lot smaller than this, but I'll film that next. So stay tuned for that. Otherwise, uh, I'll catch you in my next video. Take care. Bye.